Think about the gods of Olympus on Mount Olympus, up there bickering amongst themselves, judging the humans down here. This is the realm of correct bitching. This is the channel of correct bitching. The bitching has to be correct. So the channel of judgment, which is part of the understanding, right, the logic, which has an overarching keynote, because all collective circuitry has this keynote of sharing, is about being insatiable to correct and perfect things, to work on what has been spoiled, right? So the 18 is about working on what has been spoiled, correction. And the 58 is the joyous. It has the drive, the pressure, the vitality to correct and perfect. It is a love gate. It is, I love you together let's make a more beautiful realm let's make this world more perfect let's make it more wonderful let's make it more joyous let's make it more alive that's my unconscious uh i think it's venus so i know this gate but what happens in incorrect bitching when there's incorrect bitching instead of being collective and about sharing things that are good for all of humanity we get nitpicky and we get accused of being nitpicky and why are you so bitchy? Why are you so judgmental? Why are you always fault finding? That was my uh, second husband's complaint about me, that I was always trying to correct him and make, th make him different, yeah, change things about him. So in the not self, the 58 says, I love you. Let me fix that in you. Let me correct that for you without being recognized and invited. That's incorrect bitching. Okay, so this is that channel, channel of judgment. And now let's just look briefly, get my pen here, out at the gate activations. The 18 is in the quarter of duality, which is about relationships. So the 18 is like the first people that we start to you know be critical of our, our mother and father at some point we see that they maybe are human that they, they might lie cheat or steal do drugs or that they might misspeak or get things wrong you know it might doesn't have to be a big whole huge thing but we we tend to have this fear about our parents that's the 18 standing up and defending basic and fundamental human rights for ultimately better relationships. The 58 up here is deeply transformative. It goes through the quarter of mutation in an effort to drive things to be more perfect on the material plane, stream of taste. So you, what you're looking at are people who are designed to try and correct what is wrong with the world. That's correct bitching. So my husband and I have this together. We tend to bitch and moan. Well, I usually do the bitching, <laughs> but he definitely has his awareness too about uh, what can be fixed when it comes to the world out there. So when we're watching a movie, I'm always picking apart the editing and the storyline. As an example, we have Russell Brand. So you can see that he is a cross of consciousness and he has that channel unconscious since it's a tunnel with a partial overpass gate 58 the joyous sending this love of life up to the spleen for cleansing this is the fuel in the stream of taste it's the gate of vitality the pressure for the evolution of life in the name of the love of life the root of the art of mastery it feeds that 1648 channel of talent with its logical quality of creativity up here so 58 and 52 are the only adrenaline gates that are related to the logical process. They are oppositions in the wheel. We know that because it's part of the cross of service and crosses are always opposite each other. The arms of the cross, the sun, earth. And the 58 is the energy to correct and to challenge. So that drive to stand up against the authority. Now the 18 is about the capacity to challenge authority, the potential 
awareness, the recognition of what has been spoiled, what needs to be corrected. So recognizing when correction is necessary is the job description of this channel. That's the whole process of 5818s. To bring judgment, that's your nature. Your judgment will only come when there's something to be dissatisfied with. So in the video, you might have heard me talking about how Darshana, my, one of my mentors, has this channel. And she said, if, if things weren't broken, if things didn't need to be fixed, she wouldn't have a job. So this is impersonal. The logic, collective logic, is about making sure the pattern works. And if it doesn't, challenge it. Challenge those mothers, fathers, teachers, the government, even the whole planet. It's collective. It's not about personal correction. It's about collective corrections. We have another example. I found Osho has this channel. Actually, there's quite a lot of famous people who have this channel. I had a hard time selecting only a couple. I wanted to put in more. But here are people whoever has this, who can provide and share, okay? Providing the fuel, because that's the definition. Sharing that fuel with others. And this fuels the art of mastery. 4816s, the next channel that we're going to hear from, are about talent. So the 1858 pressurizes the stream of, of taste, which brings us our talent to surpass mastery and become an art form. The 4816 is an expression of creativity in the logic circuitry. It's the channel that brings the strength of expression of creativity in logic. So improvement of the patterns, the job description of 5818s is that. That's their job, to insatiably drive themselves, the world, to correct, challenge, perfect the collective patterns. It all depends on the design. So you can see this is a um, energy projector, not connected up to the throat. So his recognitions had to be pulled out of him by others. He's at 2-4. Once he found his mission, he educated his tribe as a cross of rulership. Here's John Voigt's design. You can see he's a cross of service. Do you see how the 58 and the 18 are both of the sons in his design. That means that this person's cross, and it's, there's not a lot of crosses that do this, that makes definition in a chart, a cross of, of service will always have that channel. So they're always designed to be dissatisfied with authorities or feel a need to challenge something or someone. They have an innate need to express their logic. It's pressured. So all of you who are with this channel, you're pressured to recognize what needs to be corrected, what can be perfected potentially. It's the potential awareness of what's wrong, what's broken with the world, with the global humanity, the collective. So when your logical evaluation or judgment is uninvited, or if it's made very personal, the result is people think you're critical. So maybe hypercritical if you've got only one side or the other and you're amplifying, hi, that's me, right? So if nobody wants to hear it, you open your mouth and it comes out as criticism, bitching, that is incorrect and leads to bitterness. So for you with this design, joy is being invited to share your judgment. What can be improved? What can be corrected? What can be challenged to make the world a more wonderful place?